First find of microplastics in human lungs. For the first time, microplastic contamination has been seen in the lungs of live humans. The particles were discovered in almost all of the samples screened. They said microplastic contamination is now pervasive throughout the globe and that there is a rising worry over the risks of health exposure. Microplastics were detected in 11 out of the 13 individuals whose tissue was sampled after surgery. Aside from PET used for bottles, polypropylene was the most frequent particle. During autopsy, researchers detected substantial levels of microplastics in the lungs of two prior studies. The microscopic particles were previously known to be inhaled and ingested via food and drink. Health problems in workers have also been associated with exposure to high amounts of microplastics. For the first time, in March, microplastics were found in human blood, demonstrating that the particles may move throughout the body and may get lodged in organs. Uncertainty persists as to the influence on health. They say that microplastics harm human cells in the lab, but air pollution particles have already been shown to get into the body and kill millions of people before they are old enough to die. In the journal Science of the Total Environment, approved for publication, the researchers utilized samples of healthy lung tissue located near to the surgical targets. It employed spectroscopy to determine the kind of plastic from particles as small as 0.003 millimeters. Control samples were also utilized to adjust for contamination levels in the background. 13 of the 20 victims whose post-mortem samples were examined for microplastics in Brazil in 2021 had an average age greater than that of Sadovsky's research subjects. More than 100 samples from lung cancer patients in the United States were found to include plastic and plant fibers, such as cotton, in a 1998 research. 97% of malignant tissue samples included the fibers, whereas 83% of non-cancerous tissue samples were infected. From Mount Everest's top to the deepest reaches of the ocean, microplastics have infiltrated the whole world and are contaminating everything. In pregnant women's placentas and in the lungs of pregnant rats, microplastics have been discovered to swiftly enter the hearts, brains, and other organs of developing fetuses.